Hello and welcome to Community Chats. I'm your host, Ali Hammer, and today we're joined with Kenneth Lam, the CTO and co-founder of Senstra. Kenneth, welcome to the show. You've always been so passionate about technology. So can you start by telling our audience a little bit about Senstra and how it fits in with your love for data and AWS? I'm an absolute data nerd. And for the last 10 years, I've been fascinated with the different facts and insights you can glean from the same set of data if you know how to use it. Uh, so I've been working with companies and organizations like New South Wales government, optimize their bill plans for their local rail networks that help people lacking transport and supporting telecom companies like NBN to improve their network maintenance and the service they deliver. Over time, what I found was these companies had challenges they couldn't solve and the data they had and they didn't know how to collect new data that they needed to solve these problems. So I started Sensure with two other founders who shared the same passion I have to use data to make this planet of ours a better and smarter place for everyone. Sensure helps companies overcome their data challenges by providing bespoke hardware and AWS powered cloud solutions tailored to provide the data analytics and insights needed to solve the problems they thought they never could. Uh, so for example, right now we're working with MBN to help them modernize their network so they can provide a cost-effective and reliable network to Australians. And Ali, to answer the second part of your question, I love AWS because it's so easy to use and has a mature understanding of data and IoT. AWS has come a long way over the last three years been using their services and has proved to be better than the competition. Right now, we just finished AWS device qualification, which had AWS going through a deep review and audit of our solution from our sensors all the way to our platform. Well, the work that you've been doing with New South Wales government and NBN is so fascinating to me. And Kenneth, I know you love AWS. Thank you so much. But why did you actually choose AWS to develop your IoT solution specifically? Um, so we chose AWS because it shares the understanding of the importance of data and how to handle it correctly to provide the insights needed to solve world problems. Uh, they manage the complexities of data handling, which not only reduces the installation and integration times, but also helps reduce maintenance times and enables Sensure to focus on problem solving and insight generation. This all leads to a lower cost and higher value generation for us and our clients. Uh, another significant reason we opted for AWS is because of the security that they offer to our overall solution. In the current world, data is absolutely, absolutely invaluable to our clients and the constant threat of data breaches is at the top of AWS's list, which aligns with us and our clients. Yeah, it's really great to hear that we are so aligned when it comes to important topics like security and keeping data safe, because as you've mentioned, we're living in a pretty scary time at the moment where data is invaluable and breaches are actually a constant threat. And Kenneth, you've also mentioned some of the customers that you work with and the problems that you solve, but can you share a little bit more about the impact and the results that you're delivering for customers like NBN or the Australian government? Uh, yeah, so uh, we've been focused on working with telecommunications and utility providers and general and government bodies, as we feel these have the challenges we want to solve to make this country and world a better place for everyone. We help companies in these industries solve their underlying problems through IoT sensor data and insights that allow them to provide a better service and experience to our communities, such as a stable power grid or, net or internet. Uh, we've been working with NBN recently and helping them monitor their critical infrastructure across Australia helping them achieve real-time monitoring of their assets, moving them from a reactive to a more proactive telecoms company, equipping them to respond to an issue and notify customers as soon as possible instead of waiting for the customer to call and complain. Uh, another example is our work with New South Wales government where we are exploring smart city solutions in monitoring microclimate and environmental data across the state. Uh, right now, we're currently looking to monitor air quality at the street level so state and council bodies can alert vulnerable communities such as asthmatic people when pollen count is high. Wow, this is so cool and such impactful and diverse examples that you've listed. And Kenneth, to round up this interview, all this is very cool, but what is the coolest technology that Sense just been helping customers with and how will this continue to kind of develop in the future? Um, so the coolest stuff we've been working on, uh, cool, to call it me at least, is all the tech we've been doing with NBN to augment their infrastructure. A lot of their assets across Australia sits in hard to reach places in underground pits or on utility poles, which in the past has made it difficult to deploy new tech such as, um, such as our solution, which operates on its own power communications. We've been able to overcome this and deliver a smart asset solution while keeping costs down and being non-intrusive to their system or network. 
which means in the end, our customers experience zero downtime when we carry out this upgrade, as we didn't have to turn off their network temporarily. We were able to do this by designing our own hardware sensors that could be installed and take readings without the need to turn off the client's hardware, also by using low power, high penetration narrowband frequencies for our communications meant we could readily extract data from hard to reach places such as their underground pits. Uh, coupling this with AWS powered cloud solutions mean we could land the data and push it to our clients in real time. Uh, we were able to deploy this with our uh, installation partner, Fulton Hogan, in 50 sites in under two weeks across Sydney and Melbourne. Wow, that's pretty impressive and very cool because there's nothing more frustrating than when your internet goes down and you're waiting on a network. So very cool that you were able to do that with no downtime. Kenneth, thank you so much. Your solution is actually really cool, even to me. So well done on everything you've created. The work that you've been doing is so impactful, as I mentioned. So thank you so much. And if anyone has any questions about Sensor or wants to know anything more, please drop them in the comment section below and we'll get back to you. Thank you so much.